Hey guys, welcome back to Nomad Plays EU4, and we're going for the Italian Ambition Camp um, achievement. So we've got about four years of um, Regency Council, which sucks because I really, really want to attack Aragon, but you know, Lady Tish has to be too young. But um, it's all right. We'll we'll just sit on our hands and just uh, wait for that to happen. The positive thing is it's allowing our aggressive expansion to drop down and everything as well. Um, you know, Milan, who you allied with Austria and Papal State. Mm. Oh, sorry, Austria pretty much allied everyone around me, didn't he? Except you, Manchua. What about Ferrara and Ferrara? So Manchua and Ferrara, we want. Oh, wasn't even paying attention. Probably should have a look around for um, what was going to happen. Um, four, two, one. Sure. <clears throat> Start moving. You're going to get there. Oh no! Wait. Another two days. Now move. You get there on the first, so you have a tick of recovery or not. Yeah, we got it. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yay! Rebels have been successfully defeated against. And we'll drop our uh, maintenance down again. We have a fair bit of an income, which is good. Um, too many military leaves, yes, but I'm not going to get rid of them. Austria truce is up with you, so we could actually embargo you. Which we will do as well as um, whoever else we're rivaled against. Who are we rivaled against? So, Burgundy, we already have a few. Damn it. Royal marriage has ended. He'll offer it again. Thank you. Um, as I was saying, Austria and Milan. I still can't believe we can actually rival Milan. They're three provinces. But whatever. Paradox logic. No, uh, recall diplomat. <clears throat> we can build more things, but I think we, yeah, we're trying to hold off and build docks instead, so we won't build anything here yet. Our army is full. Ships are not, but I think we want um, Aragon declare war on you. Really, Aragon? You idiot! Oh, um, recall diplomat. We're trying to just build up our um, navy so we can have a decent sort of landing force, but they've got a couple of heavies. Oof. France, you have heavies, only a seven. So France will be able to destroy their um, navy, hopefully. At least that's what I'm sort of banking on. Putting all my hopes on you, France. Don't let me down. <clears throat> uh, recall diplomats. So, can we ally the mighty... No, we cannot. What about the mighty... No, we cannot. Oh, rival... Uh, why do you have to have so many rivals? Uh, the steel is your rival as well. Oh, that's never gonna happen. That's right, I have um, relations up. And, are you serious? You inherited Naples. Damn it. Oh, well. Makes him stronger, that's good for us. Right. We fabricate claims as we can, or among ya. Pretty sure that's what we need. Um, military access from Castile. Well, you're my ally, so I'll allow it. And we will fabricate claim on the Bel Airs. If we take the Bel Airs, we will be able to fabricate on Tunis, if Tunis is still alive, if not, Thompson. He was allied with the Ottomans. Okay, maybe we don't want to attack them. Wow, Tunis just getting wrecked. Surprised Tunis didn't ally the Ottomans first. Holy crap. Mamluks uh being destroyed. All glory to us. Diplomatic reputation plus one. Excellent. That's what I like to see. And we can build some more docks. How far are we from? Um, look, it's on me, or Burgess lose 20 loyalty. Seriously? Genoa, friends, Provence, and Ward. So that's probably all the places that we have, um... What 
that's probably all the places that we have. Um, yeah, the bird burgers. Gain ten influence. What is it at the moment? Ooh, yeah, but we can't really do that. Lose twenty loyalty. Lose ten influence. Oh my god! I don't really want to do that either. Um. Suppose we'll just gain the autonomy. I don't really want to though. Yeah, we'll just gain the autonomy. It's fine. I don't really want it. Looming disaster. Yeah, that's Shouldn't be far though. 20 to 4 years, so yeah, that shouldn't, that shouldn't be far. Should be fine. I need 5 more points into here in order to build something else. Or we can just remove the castle. Or workshop. These things we need to decide. We'll do it eventually. It's all good. Another couple years for Tishi is well, of age, so we can actually declare wars, gain prestige, gain paper influence clergy, what are you at the moment? Mm. We do have 15 prestige, although I've been trying to actually raise it, haven't I? Uh, you know what? Ignore their demands. Give me the prestige. He is like super itchy. Um, so I don't know if I actually did I say it? This is a new day anyway. So last night I went to bed at like I think two after playing this. It is now midday and I'm finally getting back on the computer after doing my uh, morning routine. Royal marriage with Bohemia? Sure. Sure thing. And you uh to be a must be yeah. It's gonna to totally happen. Turn it Gordo. You're actually pretty. Oh, you can't be. What? Did they change their um? How did we see that again? Yeah, feudal monarchy. They changed their um government form. I'm pretty sure they weren't that before. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure they won't. Um, National Unrest, negative two, yes please. Probably gonna fall behind a bit on some technology things, but it's alright. Uh, do you know we can actually boost? Do we want to spend that many points though? Not really. It's a lot of points. <clears throat> Extra 25% thanks to heals. Damn you. I think we'll just destroy the castle, probably, and just build the, um... Uh, dock there, instead. We have everything else mothballed, so, you know, what's the point, I guess? Next month we'll be- oh, crap. We have diplomats that should be doing shit. We have improved with you. Don't need to improve with you. Don't really need to improve you. Mm, probably improve you. There's still the option that we might be able to um become the HRE. Might, might, might not. We'll see. Build another dock there. So we are going to definitely need ships to be able to actually land troops over here. Um, loots. Question is, do we want to try and build some heavies as well? 
Probably not. Disability. How much money are we making? We're making a ton. Planet. Yep, sure. Probably go for this guy. So we need 81 ducats. Give me the money. All the potential disasters. Hopefully, none happen. <clears throat> Yes! Teachers of age! And we can also get the advisor. Excellent. Um, what do we do first, guys? That's the big question. I'm thinking war. England, Provence, and Portugal. We declare war. Uh, what? I would have destabilized you. Why? You have military access through Aragon, and because of that, it's going to destabilize you. Yeah, sure. That makes perfect sense, you stupid freaking idiots. Why do you need military access through them? There is no logical reason why you would want military access. Mains are joint. Oh yeah, definitely. That's just a shoe win. Mm. Damn it. But why you stupid idiot freaking France? No. Oh. Personal union with who? France and Castile. <laughs> And yeah, I wonder who will win that one. I think France, probably. I mean, you know, 52,000 versus 22. Yeah. Nice and easy. Castile is moving in. Go Castile. Portugal, what are you doing? Oh, well, I guess we're going to just attack someone else then. Have a claim on you. We don't have a claim on you, really. gonna get one. Declare war on you, mains will join, France will join. How many points do we have in France actually? Twenty. Could also go for Burgundy. But no, we need to get land in here. So we'll bump our um, army maintenance up. Wait a couple months and then we will declare on um, Mantua. Allied with Venice. Allied with Pisa and Venice. So we'll probably attack Mantua and close belligerent um, Ferrara. See if we can take some war land. Um, 10 prestige or 50 admin. Uh, prestige. Prestige is just never meant to be. Give you this leader, and we can't turn Tisha into a general because um, she cannot lead the armies. Because she's a female, apparently females can't lead armies. Have they not heard of Jean of Arc? Like seriously. Oh, uh, we lost claim. Oh my God, we were just about to freaking declare war on you, and we lost the claim. Wonderful. So we have to wait till that claim gets formed, and then we can attack. So we may as well drop the. Um, I'm maintenance down a bit. God damn it. Game, you're screwing with me. I don't like it. Did we get discovered? Seriously? You got discovered? Oh, whatever. We're about to go to war with you, so who cares? So about probably 50, 60% will um, start funding the army again. Castile has been maxed. Excellent. France. I really hate how it does this. Because they're giving military access to France, it's going to destabilize them if I go to war with them. That's just the stupidest friggin' thing ever. That's what they want. That's what they want to do, so you know. Whatever. Available mercenaries. See, it used to have like a number of how many of each you could build, it doesn't do that anymore. So I don't see what's the point to have that um, bonus before anymore. 
We have an heir. Petro. Sure. Ah. <sighs> Uh, what? You can actually... Since when did that happen? We can turn Teach into a general. Do we want that? Duke. Was it... I swore I said it was a dude... Ah, uh, a chick. Okay, apparently Teach is a dude. That's even... More disturbing for me now. Anywho, Teach. You are now a general. And you are god-awful. You will not lead any armies. And we'll bump our, um... I meant up. I swore I said it was a female. Oh well. Agent was discovered, so that's gonna slow the process, which sucks. But oh, living disaster. But that's not gonna finish. I think. Pretty sure. Pretty sure it's gonna end. Yeah, fifteen twenty-eight in February, so a couple months, and then that disaster is gonna go away. Are there any things we can do? Tax for contribution. Exchange donation. Raise levies. Yeah, no. we're all good. We're losing claims, guys. I'm not happy. Colonist heretics plus three. Idea cost negative ten. Excellent. That would have been good earlier on, though. Replicate claim on Holy Milan. We can tech up if we want it, but I don't really want to. So we'll probably put some points into development, I guess. And development. Where do we want to develop? Probably here. We're honest. It's cheaper there. So probably here. Probably with that. And that should do. Plus, they're not accepted culture right now. That sucks. May just have to convert them. I don't think. Oh, that's that land. That land. Hmm. Now, 70, excellent. Mains has religious civil disorder. That's just great. My ally having problems with religious um, rebels. What I want. Eighty-two percent. That is growing so slow. I really hate that whole agent discovered so everything gets slowed down. Shit. I don't think it used to do that. I'm pretty sure you just got um, aggressive expansion if you got discovered. That was it. Heretics. Protestants. Oh, that's right. No, I forgot about that. Jure. Bohemia has. Oh, we're no longer all married to. Hmm. Oh, that's right, he's Protestant. I was like, why is our relationship so low? Sure, Bohemia. I'm only doing that just in case somehow your heir, or your heir dies, or you die, or something, and we can take control of you, basically. Um, National Unrest, or... Probably National Unrest, yeah. Get all the point generation happening. 95%? Come on, so close. Tell us of the Council of Dijon. What's that mean? To be honest, I didn't really read it that much, but no. That's right. Provence has somehow managed to get a fair few um, pieces of land back. Take Mantua, sure. Now yeah, we can actually declare war, France. You still... Just... Makes no sense to me. Makes no sense at all. You would destabilize us. And you like them as well, which is a pain in the butt. You should hate them. Hate them because I hate them. So we can, um... Increase national unrest, port missionary strength, but again, we don't need that. We don't need it at all. Mantua! Declare war and your allies will come in. We will... Weren't you allied to Ferrara? I thought you were. 
Oh no, it's Venice that's the um, glue that holds it all together. So you will just um, attack main, sure. Sure. Bring in... Fran Bohemia or France? Bohemia probably can't get um, through here, can he? He's probably rivaled. No, he's not. Hmm. Oh. How strong is Venice now? Ledger. Military armies. Force limits. Venice. 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 Where is Venice? But Jenniger. You are pretty strong. Venice down. They only have 21, really? So they're over their force limit as well. Oh, that's manpower. But they are over the force limit. By one. Yeah. And we're all the way up here, 36. So yeah, I'm not really concerned about um, Venice anymore. Oh, they probably want to stomp this, ar uh, this army quickly because Venice is going to come around to support them. So declare war, take Mantua, bring in Bohemia. Let's see what happens. If Bohemia can come down, we might as well use him for something, right? March. And the army was ruffle stomped. That's good for us. Bring you guys back here. This is farmland, so we will definitely just march straight on them. Um, we'll have to pull our navy back. Can we get them back in time? Oh, crap, I didn't even think about that. Um, Castile. Uh... Arcs Fleet Basin Rides, yes. And hide in their docks, basically. So France and Mainz will both come in. I didn't see the point of bringing Mainz in. I mean, he's having rebel bombs anyway. Ooh. That was actually a decent size for us. I suppose we can't march, or we can. Should have done that soon. Okay, well, we'll take down Pisa. Buys the cost negative 15%. Yeah, I'm not going to loyalty. Nobility and clergy, we can't really. Mm. We can make them happy at least. We can't make these guys happy though. Yeah, hate these stupid events. Global trade power we lose. Burgers lose 20 loyalty. Nobility estate gains loyalty. So I don't understand this, we're losing army and navy tradition, but nobility is, um, gaining friggin' loyalty. That just makes no sense to me. Visor cost down would be nice. Yeah. So what I'm thinking here is if we choose this, we go and we don't have um, a negative to our manpower recovery speed, which is gonna be bad because of our war, but we have a big manpower pool, so apparently we are over our manpower pool as well. Don't know how that happened. Uh, oh that's right, the thirty three percent um increase in autonomy everywhere. But if we do this as well, we will lose Armitage, which helps with morale. Morale is more important, I think. We also lose administration points, is it bags that we have an administration idea? Hmm. That's the alarm. 
I think we're just gonna have to take the this one. So yeah, I'll leave it there, guys. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to like and subscribe to keep up to date on all future content. And um, yeah, um, feel free to leave a comment down below if you think that I should have taken the other option of that ad um, advice. Oh, that you know decision just there. I may may have. I don't know. Anyway, take care, guys. See you later.